Freddie Grant appeared in court Wednesday showing no emotion, represented by his attorney, Richland County Public Defender Fielding Pringle. Grant pled guilty to the murder and kidnapping of Gabby Swainson. As part of a deal with the solicitor's office, Grant will receive 30 years for his murder charge and 30 years for his kidnapping charge. Both of these sentences will run concurrently, which means he will essentially serve 30 years for both crimes. The deal also included the dropping of all charges against Grant's daughter. However, Grant did have to agree to waive all future rights to appeal his conviction. Solicitor Dan Johnson made it very clear in court he did not want to ever negotiate with Grant at all, but felt it was necessary to end this nightmare for Elvia Swainson, Gabby's mother. Every time the phone rings, it, you know, she's wondering whether or not it could be the sheriff calling to tell her that she's been located. Uh, that, is, that is the torment uh, that I had to weigh uh, and looking her in the eyes and whether we were going to do this. And he says there will be criticism that Grant's sentence was too light for his crimes. I, I know there's going to be people who, who question it, uh, but to bring closure for her, uh, for, for me, uh, and I know for, for the sheriff, uh, was what we were trying to do. In addition to learning what time Grant will serve in prison, we also learned exactly how he killed Gabby. Dan Johnson revealed in court that Gabby's official cause of death was asphyxiation or strangulation. We learned Grant snuck into the Swainson's home sometime after Gabby's mother left for work at 3.45 a.m., kidnapped Gabby, and eventually killed her. And did Grant ever show any remorse for what he did? Absolutely none whatsoever. Not the moment that he walked me out there and pointed to where she was at in the ground. Uh, no time whatsoever has he ever did any remorse a bit, not one bit. Sure. He's, he's still a monster. I mean, he was the monster to the very end. In Columbia, Stephanie Helling, Watch Fox News.
In Columbia, Stephanie Helling, Watch Fox News.